Have you ever wondered what happens when a star dies? Stars, the cosmic powerhouses, undergo fascinating transformations at the end of their lifespans. Stars spend most of their lives fusing hydrogen into helium in their cores, a phase known as the main sequence. As they exhaust their hydrogen fuel, their fate diverges based on their mass. For stars like our Sun, the depletion of hydrogen leads to the fusion of helium into heavier elements such as carbon and oxygen. Eventually, these stars shed their outer layers, creating a beautiful planetary nebula, while the core cools and contracts into a white dwarf, a dense, Earth-sized remnant that gradually fades over time. In contrast, massive stars undergo a more violent end. After exhausting their nuclear fuel, they fuse elements up to iron, which doesn't produce energy through fusion. This leads to a catastrophic collapse of the core, resulting in a supernova explosion, the most powerful explosion observed in the universe. The remnant core may become a neutron star or, if sufficiently massive, a black hole. These stellar deaths are not just endings but also beginnings. Supernovae scatter heavy elements into space, seeding future generations of stars and planets, and ultimately, the building blocks of life itself. So the next time you gaze at the night sky, remember that the death of stars is a crucial part of the cosmic cycle, leading to the creation of new stars, planets, and perhaps even life.